question number 4 right did sir john buy christmas present on december 15 how did the tada get to know about it hurry up did sir john buy christmas presents on december 15 How did the Tata get to know about it? Type your answer. Hurry up! I'm waiting. There are two questions, and you need to answer both. Okay. Okay. Correct, Bani. Hurry up! Type the answer. Only Bani has given the answer. Did Sir John buy Christmas presents on December fifteen? How did the Tada get to know about it? Yes, correct answer. So Bani is saying yes as he sent. him the telex angel is saying that tada got to know from the letter that sir john had bought christmas presents on december 15 it indicated that the project was successful see instead of writing letter write down telex okay that tada knew about sir john buying the christmas presents from a letter from okay he got a telex and that time he came to knew came to know okay and then How did the Tata get to know about it? This is already answer. And did Sir John buy Christmas presents? Yes, he bought Christmas present on December fifteen because the project was successful. Okay. Why, according to Indrani Devi, had the comet not been disastrous? Do you agree with her? Again, two questions. First is. Okay, Agni is saying yes. Sir John bought Christmas gifts on December fifteen. He sent an urgent telex message to the Tada to tell him. Correct. And Mole is saying Sir John wrote a telex to Mr. the Tada, and he was confident now of buying the Christmas present on December. 15. On December fifteen, comet was at the distance of eighty thousand km. Uh, okay, eighty thousand, and the project was successful, and it had gone far away. Okay, she thought that. Okay. Next question: Why, according to Indrani Devi, had the comet not been disastrous? Do you agree with her? Wait. Bani is saying she thought that it was destroyed by the yajna that was performed by his grandson. No, we. No, I do not agree. Give reasons, Bani. Why don't you agree? Okay. Indrani Devi thought that comet Dutta could not harm the Earth because of the Yajna performed at their house. No, I don't agree. Her thought, okay. Rani Devi thought that Comet Dutta could not harm the Earth because of the yajnas performed at their house. Because of Shanti Yajna, Rani Devi thought that Comet Dutta could. See, you have to write why don't you agree? Superstition. you have to you are not supposed to write just no i don't agree why give reason like first why according to indrani devi had the comet not been disastrous because uh, according to her uh, it was the blessing of you can say his guru ji her guru ji and the yajnas performed okay so that is why no harm but now do you agree with her for this you need to explain What is your opinion? Because her opinion was completely based on superstitions. Okay, correct, Akshima. As the comet is very disastrous and it needed a scientific method to destroy. Okay, Bani. I don't agree with her thought because it's all superstitions. Okay. Yes, you don't agree. because there is no scientific reason there is no logical you can say reason behind the thinking or behind indrani devi's 
perform uh, that yajnas and all and then according to indrani devi the comet was not disastrous because they had performed the yajna in their house but i don't agree with her because it is just a superstition the reality is that the comet's path was changed by the efforts of scientists correct agni correct answer the there was proper meeting conference and then calculations after that they came to one solution they uh, executed that properly so everything was logical correct that is why you need to write that you don't agree she is old minded okay so she believed in yajnas okay ashita last question is datta das general outlook rational moral traditional choose one and then you have to give reason why okay and mole is giving answer number 5 according to indrani devi the comet had not destroyed the earth because of the yajna that koka performed and also with the blessings of guruji but i don't agree with her because it was superstitious and the comet did not hit the earth only because of scientists hard work correct about his thinking bani what do you think is it rational means logical moral or traditional correct akshima correct answer rational correct it was rational not traditional rational his outlook was rational now why why do you think so he had a scientific temperament he went by reason not by custom or morality okay correct datta das general outlook is rational he has a scientific approach scientists are rational in their approach to a problem they have analytical mind that is why datta das is against all the superstitions and unnecessary rituals he did not participate in the yajna performed at his house chalo he destroyed the comet with scientific method okay so his general outlook is rational right he didn't believe in any superstitious things right superstition and then he was he had again scientific temperament right he believed in logic only and he knew that every thing that happens has some kind of logic okay rational because he thought scientifically and always tried to find a scientific reason for him yajnas and other rituals were just superstition correct abhi correct answer he does not believe in outdated rituals and ceremonies he is truly a scientist and has a scientific attitude to life correct akshima okay rational because he found solutions to prove everything with science yes angel correct okay now next part first question is kind of debate okay should a scientist's findings be suppressed if they seem disturbing like they did in the chapter they didn't want to publish james paper right because um, it would it seemed disturbing right so now what do you think should a scientist findings be suppressed if they seem disturbing give reasons for and against the topic for and against the topic hurry up should a scientist finding be suppressed if they seem disturbing what do you think now it is up to you you can give reasons for or against the topic what do you feel ये क्वेश्चन फोर मार्क्स के लिए इजीली आ सकते हैं 
these are value based questions right so these questions can come now it's up to you hurry up give answer should the scientists finding be suppressed yes no first question me for and against dono pe likha uh anvil your wish if you have enough reasons for the topic then for if you think you can write in favor and against then you can also choose this method but first answer me this what do you think should a scientist finding be suppressed or not hurry up yes prabal okay no scientists discovery are true we should not ignore them there is a reason behind it okay yashika what about others hurry up what are you waiting for what do you think no the scientists try to discover the truth the factual position is his findings are based on thorough research hence these should not be suppressed or ignored okay angel you are saying no yashika is saying no what about others asa akshima anmol maybe they can just not be spread much if they are disturbing okay paramjit raghav is saying no a scientist findings should not be suppressed even if they seem disturbing it is because suppression can lead to frustration of the scientist promotion to such findings can give birth to many new discoveries okay hurry up hurry up no we should not suppress bani suppress dear discoveries as there is lot of hard work behind it okay no a scientist finding should never be suppressed or ignored because he she tries to discover the truth behind unknown spatial objects through scientific reason and research nicolas copernicus was one such mathematician and astronomer he created a model of the universe prabal do you know about him a scientist finding should not be suppressed but if it is like james in the story then it is needed to be hidden for some time until a solution is found correct abhi suppressed because it would create unwanted panic in the world only some important people and scientists should be informed not suppressed because some people can still find some solution and people can prepare for it okay correct anvil javan your and prabal's answer is same okay so this is general question write what you feel now do you think ours is a traditional yes abhi i know they have copied from net do you think ours is a traditional society what are some of the things we do to be called traditional do you find these things useful or useless and i think first answer is yes our society is traditional as if any accident occur the family first goes to prayer okay bani okay we believe in god right no doubt ours is a traditional society we are traditional because we believe in so many religious rituals and ceremonies and most of these are useless okay then what about others hurry up akshima has given the answer bani's answer first answer is yes without any doubt that our society is traditional society now just tell me what are the some what are some of the things we do to be called traditional 
and do you find these things use less or useful and let me tell you these questions are very important directly for four or five marks and maybe a writing skill full fledged writing skill hurry up hurry up type your answer as india is also known as a traditional country we find it cool and we perform rituals okay it, mostly it is related to religion right following rituals doing ceremonies just to look traditional is what most of our society do these days okay paramjit then hurry up hurry up hurry up hurry up um akshima you can you can write if you want to relate this to your chapter and most most of the times we relate okay so related to the chapter and you can write about in rani devi and if this question comes in general means you can say as a writing skill then there is no need to write about in rani devi but if it comes in literature part definitely hurry up we are we have two more questions what are some of the things we do to be called traditional do you find these things useless or useful yes they are useless nowadays modern people do not believe in them people on different occasions perform different rituals um and perform various ceremonies if anything wrong happens people go for prayers in religious places some rituals and traditions are useless as they do not have any logic okay okay yashika science is useful to us uh wait 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 bani yes as society is traditional we usually do havans for shanti people do puja for new god vehicles according to me such rituals are useless but believe in god always stop believe in god always stop us from doing wrong and give us peace of mind okay correct chalo give two or three examples to show how science has been useful to us i think not only two or three we are we have so many examples but still how science has been useful to us if combined if i combine these two questions it could be a like speech ours is a traditional society we observe past we take parts in yajnas we feed priests on special occasions to pacify our dead ancestors souls we do many rituals on the occasions of wedding in our families when a child is born in our families many traditional things are observed in many in my opinion some of these things are useful because they boost up our moral values they are helpful in improving our atmosphere some of these traditional things are harmful because they block our path of progress correct trouble some are useful some are definitely useless right so now give two or three examples to show how science has been useful to us vani has given the answer science is useful to us as many ways uh in many ways as if any disaster come we get to know about it 24 hours before okay like comet okay this way science is useful any other way okay because of the huge evolution in science we are now able to attend our classes even in these difficult circumstances very good paramjit nice good example
ओके यशिका करेक्ट करेक्ट बेसिकली बिकॉज ऑफ साइंस ये साइंस हैज एडवांस राइट एंड नाउ वी हैव सो मेनी ऑप्शन ऑल्सो एंड एज मानी हैज सेट दैट वी कम टू नो अबाउट एनी नेचुरल क्लैमिटी बिफोर हैंड एंड वी कैन प्रिपेयर फॉर दैट ऑल्सो करेक्ट देन आर इफ वी टॉक अबाउट साइंस देन लेट्स टॉक अबाउट दैट स्पेस शटल्स मून एंड एवरीवेयर correct we have reached everywhere scientific discoveries have made human life more comfortable than before most of the progress in the world is because of science it has helped men in fighting diseases correct fighting diseases also most inventions like electricity technology steam engine etc there is no field of life where science is not helpful correct with the help of science we can connect to people who are far away from us okay चलो साइंस इज द शावर ऑफ नॉलेज साइंटिफिक टेक्नोलॉजीज मेक आर लाइफ सो इजियर इट प्रोटेक्टेड अस फ्रॉम नेचुरल एज वेल एज फिजिकल क्लैमिटीज इट हेल्प्स अस टू सिंपली अडॉन आर डेली एक्टिविटीज वी कैन इजीली कम्युनिकेट विद अदर्स विद द हेल्प ऑफ साइंटिफिक थिंग्स बिकॉज ऑफ साइंस वी कैन डू आर वर्क इवन फास्टर वी कैन गो एनीवेयर वी वांट इट हैज चेंज्ड द लाइफ ऑफ मॉडर्न मैन man has conquered over many fatal diseases with the help of science man has developed modern means of transport yes means everywhere we use science correct whether we like it or not but still we are thankful okay washing machine fans cooler air conditioner mobile phones smartphones tube lights other like space science medical science information technology all are science correct in modern times the science has become one of the important part of our lives today science has made our lives easier than the early period we easily came to know about come to know about disasters comets beforehand and we can prepare for that many other technologies and inventions made the communication traveling easier yes we now can explore solar system we know about solar system right we know about different planets we continuously uh observe the movement of different planets and all correct so yes science has been useful to us but now how science has been misused and has a result as a result been harmful to us iska i think one only one answer that is in the field of uh, wars i think if science has uh, made us powerful it has also led us to destruction correct So what do you think? Give one example to show how science has been misused and has a as a result been harmful to us. Hurry up! Atomic energy and weapons. Correct. Are the biggest misuse of science. Correct. science has been misused by many people they can hack anybody's phone id's by password science has done many discoveries due to science discovery of many alcoholic medicines and drugs have been done um uh, yeshika your answer is not clear okay harmful chemicals then man has developed deadly weapons with the help of science these deadly weapons have been used frequently by people to kill others these weapons have taken the lives of a large number of people bombs bomb blast with remote controls yes has been a beautiful harmful in invention of science correct these are harmful in inventions okay so man has misused science by producing weapons of mass destruction like atom and hydrogen bombs they can bring about widespread destruction in no time correct you can give examples of uh, again we have one common example nagasaki hiroshima right how the those cities were destroyed in seconds and now with the invention of these planes and all 
it has become very easy okay and if we talk about science uh, what about this corona virus nuclear bombs are being used which if used again can destroy our whole world and also vehicles which were made for comfortable traveling are now being misused and are causing global warming many drugs are produced now bani now drugs to hum usse positive way mein bhi le sakte hain for curing diseases see these these types of questions can come for five marks or for writing skills so collect as many as examples points you can got it bad type of drugs like alcohol okay 